Well lads, what's the crack? My name is Orgy Runner and welcome to PT, playable teaser for Unreal Engine 4 or based upon Unreal Engine 4. Now this game was made from the ground up based on the original PT that came out on the PS4 back in I believe it was 2014 but it was pulled from the store because uh, Konami being the jackass that they are got into an argument, disagreement with um, and that's putting it lightly yeah, they got into an argument, disagreement with Hideo Kojima and Guillermo del Toro, and yeah, it was pulled from the store, and we never got our uh, Silent Hill game. But all that has been fixed now, kind of, but not really. Hideo Kojima is now working on a game. Uh, what is it called? Uh, oh God, I forgot. Um, Death Stranding or Death Stand. Dead Stranding, that's the game, that, that's the name of the game that he's working on now. But I will get into all of that afterwards, but I should need to because this was a pretty big controversy at the time. Anyway, Radius Scordello, that is the developer, I believe. Watch out, the gap in the door. It's a separate reality. The only me is me. Are you sure the only you is you? Very metaphorical, very um, interesting to say the least. I do love a bit of a brain tease from time to time. Anyway, I never got to play this game at the time because I only got my PS4 back in the Christmas of 2016 going into 2017. So, yeah, the game was pulled way before then. So, yeah. And so far, it's looking nice. The father went to the trunk of his car retrieved the rifle and shot his wife as she was cleaning up the kitchen after lunch. When his 10-year-old son came to investigate the commotion, the father shot him too. His six-year-old daughter had the good sense to hide in the bathroom, but reports suggest he lured her out by telling her it was okay, just no. a game. The girl was found No, 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 I don't want to hear about that stuff. Because, um... That stuff does happen in real life, and it does kind of disturb me to even hear about it. Oh, no, 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 no. I mean, I know it's a horror game, I know it's a work of fiction, but it does kind of hit close to home. I mean, when you know that this stuff, as I said, does happen in real life. And it's just completely frightening to hear about it. Alright, um, but getting back into the game. No, I'm not gonna play stupid here, I know what to do. Be okay, thank you for doing that, because the developer included a guide which I read through because I don't want to go through this completely, you know, blind. I mean, I, I don't want it to be spoiled, but at the same time, I don't want to be walking around like a dumbass. Okay, we got a picture here. My voice. Can you hear it? This sign. Can you read it? I'll wait forever if you'll just come to me. Yes, I love putting on a deep, bassy voice for those seven notes, or this type of dialogue. Well, there's no real dialogue other than the text. Dialogue is audio, isn't it? Or can dialogue be uh, textualized as well? I'm not sure. Okay, either way, uh, I think I just walked through here. No one said anything about creepy ladies being in this game. <gasps> Okay, I was just kidding about that part. Of course, there's, there's a creepy lady. Of course, there's a creepy lady named Lisa. Now, I'm not sure if the playable teaser had any relevance or or any direct links to what was supposed to be the new Silent Hill game. I'm not sure. I assume it had. Possibly, probably, but we'll never know. Uh, look in here. Let the door slam in my face. That is good. That is nice. Okay, 
right, then we go down through this door. Lisa, how you doing? Uh, you look like you've seen better days. Alrighty then. Yeah, I'm getting out of here. The music just got more uh, not monotonous. Um, not sure what the word is I'm looking for, but I'll just say spooky. Okay, let me pick up this light. Okay. Oh, hello. Oh, no, no, no. Shh. Shh, 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 shh. Oh, God, that's so disturbing. Can I leave? God, no, I want to leave. Oh, thank you. Oh, that is gross. That was one of the worst things I've seen in a long while. The father purchased the rifle used in the crime at his local gun store two days earlier. Okay, did I look at this picture, I think, and press X. There you go. Don't touch that dial now. We're just getting started. Retrieved the rifle and shot his wife. Nope, I'm out. I don't want to hear none of your nonsense. Jesus, man. Oh boy, I know I love to complain about jump scares from time to time, but Jesus Christ. When they're done right, they can be very effective. Okay, uh, what does this say? Forgive me, Lisa. There's a monster inside of me. Yeah, you might want to see an exorcist about that. Okay, so what now? Oh. After killing his family, the father hung himself with a garden hose they had in the garage. Mm -mm. I don't even want to know what's in that fridge. Okay, anything different here? Ah uh, yes, it says hello. I know what to do for this one because I'm smart. Well, that is smart enough to read a guide. I can hear them calling me from L. And you probably have a good idea what it will spell out. Okay, so we're missing an L, so that's back here. Oh no, wait, an E. Yeah, I can hear them calling me from hell. So is that it? Oh boy, yeah, this playable teaser, it definitely is on a whole new level of disturbing. Is 
that Latin you're speaking? Or Italian. Or French. I don't know. And to be honest, I don't want to know. Sounds like you're summoning a demon. Oh, I know what I have to do here now. Um, I have to find like a little hole in the wall. Oh, but this is creepy as hell, man. Just the sound. Oof. Alright, here we go. Look at it. That was not a happy sound. You got fired, so you drowned your sorrows in booze. She had to get a part-time job working a grocery store cash register. Only reason she could earn a wage at all is the manager liked how she looked in a skirt. You remember, right? Exactly ten months back. Huh. You're pretty mouthy for a, um... Yeah, uh, I, I don't even want to say it. These eyes are pretty creepy. But you know what, um, I think if they weren't typical GIFs, rather, um, properly implemented... I, I don't even know what the type of file, what type of file you'd use to make these run more smoothly, but uh, you, you know what I mean. Because they're GIFs, they don't have that um, smooth flow to them. I don't know. I don't know what I'm talking about half the time either. But you get what I mean. The animation for the eye needs to be smoother. That's the point I was trying to make. I'm not sure what loop this is. I think it's loop number six. Oh, you have to pick up six pieces of paper here. So here's one. They're for a photo. Number two is here. Somewhere. Okay, that's two got. Number three is right here in the corner. And we got four up here. And five. Now we just wait until the game glitches out. So I'll just... Like I was saying, I'll skip to that part. Alright, here we are. Development halted due to inexplicable bug. And back at the start. Radius Gordello. Watch out, the gap in the door. It's a separate reality. The only me is me. Are you sure the only you is you? Damn sure. Okay, and I think we are nearing the end. I think this is the last loop. So what we gotta do for this one is stay put right back at the window and wait for the clock to hit 12. Okay, actually, no, I'm wrong. I'm totally wrong in this one. There is one more piece of the puzzle we have to pick up. It's down here on the stairs. Okay, there we go. Oh, 
our flashlight is red this time around. Or is this a glitch? I think it could be a glitch. Alright, now it's back to normal. Okay, so I'm pretty sure this time, this time we have to turn around here and wait, 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 wait. We have to wait for this to strike 12. So we just turn around here and wait a few seconds. But you have to be still. Alright. And then we take 10 paces forward. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And wait for baby to squawk. Oh, yeah, there we go. Then we can turn around and let Lisa scare the shit out of us. Hey Lisa, where are you? I don't know where she is, I can't see her. She's gone. And I messed it up. I think. Yeah, I messed it up. Now she's not here anymore. God damn it. See, Lisa has to be inside for this to work, so because she wasn't in sight, or at least I don't think she was in sight, it didn't work out, so I um, have to go through the same rigmarole again. Okay, now Scary Lisa should be down here. Oh yeah, there she is! Okay, you can stay right where you are. Please. Not another step. Okay, she's gone, so this time it should work. There's that call I've been expecting. Hello? You've been chosen. I've been chosen, huh? I hope I've been chosen to win something nice. Like a million yo-yos. There's a lot of things I could do with a million yo-yos. And by yo-yos I mean euros. It's just uh, Dublinese slang. <laughs> And I think that's the end. Dad was such a drag. Every day he'd eat the same kind of food, dress the same, sit in front of the same kind of games. Yeah, he was just that kind of guy. But then one day he goes and kills us all. He couldn't even be original about the way he did it. I'm not complaining. I was dying of boredom anyway. But guess what? I will be coming back, and I'm bringing my new toys with me. Okay, so that was Unreal PT by Redius Cordello.
you know, it was such a shame that Silent Hills got cancelled because there was so much hype for it because there was such a huge gap between Silent Hill Downpour and the new one. Everybody was waiting for, for a new game and of course Konami delivered when they brought aboard Gilmo del Toro. And of course uh, Gilmo del Toro is uh, world renowned for his sort of horror movies. And then of course on top of that you had Norman Reedus who would have been the protagonist or the character you play as. That would have been so badass. I mean boy that would have been the pinnacle of Silent Hill games had it come to light but uh Konami being Konami, they said, nah, screw you guys, we don't like you. Well, that's not really how it went down. I'm not sure what the whole uh, hoopla was behind it. They just got into a disagreement with Konami, or pff, they just got into a disagreement with Hideo and Guillermo del Toro, and they threw their toys out of the pram and cancelled the whole damn thing. <sighs> but, um... Of course, Gilmo del Toro now and Hideo are working on Death Stranding, so that should be good. Whenever it gets a release date. Um, is it being released this year or next year? I'm not sure. I mean, nobody knows at this stage whether it's going to be a next-gen game or a current-gen game. Because it's just completely up in the air at the moment, but hopefully it won't be cancelled. I, I, I doubt that, that it will. Maybe there will be uh, some more footage actual gameplay footage this time at E3 2019 and maybe a release date to go along with it so that will be nice as well uh, anyway um, did I have anything else to add yes I did but on top of cancelling uh, the Sand Hills game Konami had the cheek and the gall to ban Hideo Kojima from the Game Awards of 2015 because he had won an award for Metal Gear Solid 5, but he was not allowed to collect it. But I believe it was uh, Kiefer Sutherland. I think I have the name right. Kiefer Sutherland collected the award, or the award on Kojima's behalf, which was awesome. But boy, the when he said uh, that Hideo couldn't be there because he wasn't allowed to be there, Booze that came from everyone in the audience. Oh boy, you could hear that from space nearly enough. And that right there is what made Konami the shittiest game company to ever walk the earth. Now, I'm not uh, going to shit on their games. Because they're good. I mean, you've got the likes of Sand Hill, Metal Gear Solid. Uh, I can't really name other Konami games except for ones on the NES maybe. But other than that, that was next level shit because as bad as EA are now and as bad as Blizzard are I don't think they could ever top what Konami did to Kojima you would have to try really hard to beat Konami at, at that yeah, okay right um, that was that little bit of a spiel so guys you want to do if you did enjoy this video be sure to give it a thumbs up comment share it with your friends and most importantly subscribe and I will see you in the next one so until next time See ya.